I really believe Chef Ranch is gonna, gonna like the food. I think that 97% of my food will be great. The food is not the problem here. It's either the atmosphere, the ambience, or the service. My food is the best food that's possibly made. But the problem with the restaurant is that we're fighting so much. Hello. First name is? Catalina. Catalina. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting Excellent. you. And you're the? I'm one of the owners, Latch. Chef. Okay. I have a partner, Marcelo is his name. Right. We used to be married. We've been separated for two years. You used to be married? To my partner. Oh, Jesus. It's just like water and oil. We just don't mix anymore. Don't mix. And it's just like conflict all the time. Well, it's all about the uh, food. I'll have a look through the menu. Nice to meet you. Same here. Okay, right, enjoy your lunch. Thank you. Oh, my God. A real interesting decor, yeah. It's almost like a sort of garage sale uh, gone wrong. How are you, sir? Good, how are you? Yeah, for D, thank you. Uh, let's start off with chicken classic soup. Let's go for the pescado marinara, the tilapia. Yeah? Absolutely. I really believe Chef Ranch is gonna, gonna like the food. I think that 97% of my food will be great. Thank you very much. That was very fast. Very fast indeed. Let's hope it's good. But can I have the soup hot? It's cold. Hot. It's cold. Wow. Let me get that hot for you, okay? Please. Absolutely. Uh, he would like a hot soup, not cold. Who said that? Uh, Ramsey said. What happened with the soup? I have a thermometer here, boiling hot. You want to check? You want to check with me? It wasn't boiling hot? And now you see it's, it's, it's boiling it's, hot. Listen. Now it is, but when it went out, it, it, it was. Before you you guys send something out, please check, double yeah. check, yeah. triple check, check one more yes. time. Yes, yes. Listen, go to your bar. I'm sorry about that. Don't worry. Just when I went to taste these, these are so salty. I mean, you'd need six mojitos before you start eating six spoons of that. You're right. They're disgusting. Excuse me, let me take this back. What a shame. We couldn't get the basics right. Do me a favor. In the place, try the beans. Man. Marcelo, try the beans. Salty as hell. Throw it out! Get it together, Marcelo! Control! Listen, I try to control take. everything. Take. I try to control take. everything. Take a I'm gonna take, I'm everything. gonna take. No, no listen. Control things. Throw them out. You're changing for new listen. ones. Listen. Let me fix the fix the cheese. Let me fix the cheese. Okay, Paco. Let me fix the cheese. Holy crap. Get out of here. Let me turn it up. Oh my god. There's definitely, definitely a lack of harmony in the kitchen. It's not getting cold. Instead of arguing, do it, do it, do it, do it now. I want this one. Die like now. Oh my god, that's gonna be a complete disaster. Change the beans and do what you have to do. Now go out here. I'm not going out. Go out here. I'm not. Go out of my kitchen. No. Go out of my kitchen. Go out of my kitchen. Now. How you doing? Yeah, fine, thank you. And you? I'm oh, fine. Can I get you anything else while you wait? Um, for no, the... I'm gonna wait for the tilapia. Okay. Thank you. I hope it comes out right. Thank you very much. All right. Wow, I know, I can't believe it. The beans, the basic of us. I hope you enjoy it, because it's actually my favorite dish. Thank you. Delicious. Wow. You love it? Yeah, he loves it. The fish is not cooked. The fish is not cooked. Ah, it's really not. That is a shame. I'm gonna bring it back. That's a very big mistake on behalf of the kitchen. ¿Qué pasó? Not cooked. Raw fish. What's wrong with you guys? It's raw. It's, it's raw. not cooked. I put the tester, the, the no oven no tester. Burn. Raw. This is raw. Raw, raw, fish. raw, raw, raw. This never comes raw. What's wrong? Hey! Excuse me. Center Catalina, please. Marcelo can not handle pressure. He should not be in the kitchen at all. One, two, three filters, and everything's coming out wrong? Unbelievable. Goodbye. Hello. Hi. How are you? Like Nellie's, I'm Lexi. Right. Sister number two. Sister number two. Yes. Right. You are glamorous. Thank you. Amazing, amazing. Um, what's that smell? Is it just me? 
I don't you smell, smell it. it. Go outside, take a big deep breath of fresh air. I don't know, I smell your cologne, which smells good. No. <laughs> okay, wait. Ready? Let's do it. No, it doesn't smell to you there. No, no I just smell just you. Just there. I just smell you. Ready? Did somebody die in here last night? No. It's okay. possible. Jesus. No. Oh, okay. What kind well, of I'm, is that? All right, I, follow I, me, I haven't tasted the food yet. All right. Oh, I'd love to meet Dad. All right, I'll go get him. What's that smell? Can you smell something? No. Oh. no. <laughs> How are you? Good to see you. Same here, sir. Come and say hello. And you are? Lewis. Lewis. The manager. You're the manager? Yes. Yeah, good to see you. Same here. Dad? Yes, ma'am. Chef Ramsey would like to meet you. Me? Meet Why you? me? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Why would he want to meet you? Follow me. I am quite nervous about Chef Ramsey's visit and how my dad's self-esteem will take it because he has a hard time taking criticism. This is Good my father, you. Mike. Mike? I'm Mike. Pleasure. But the fact is we need the help and if somebody's willing to give it to us, we need to take it. I really hope that he can help Dad. How long have we been open? 15 years. 15 years. Yeah, when was the last time you changed something in the dining room? Uh, never. Wow. Everything's pretty much as I bought it. Yeah. 15 years ago. And how would you rate your food, 1 to 10? I would rate my food in the upper 9s. Wow. Great, I love that. Uh, I can't wait yeah. to taste it. The food is not the problem here. It's Thank either you. the atmosphere, the ambience, or the service. Here's your regular menu, and here's your specials menu, sir. Is this a little PP on my menu? <laughs> on this one. <laughs> <laughs> Is that, is that? I don't know. That's not a Euro in Stain, no. I don't think so. No. I'm pretty sure it's probably coffee. Okay, great. Thank you. If you need anything, I'm at the front. Oh, smell. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. How are, How are you? I'll be your server tonight. Uh, good to see you. Can you smell that? Or is it just me? You smell something, right? <laughs> yes. Honestly, it's like we've buried like, bodies underneath the carpet. Yes, it's most definitely the carpet. It stinks. I, the restaurant is filthy, disgusting. It's full of mold. It's worse over there. Oh, shit. <laughs> Seriously? You're in the good part. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> um, steak and seafood, and we have Italian food. Uh, Ginny, what is it? Fine dining restaurant? Are we Italian? What are we? I don't know. Wow. There is no identity. Okay. I'll start up with greenery with shrimp sauce. Okay. And let's go for chicken Murphy. And then the special menu, the steak nelly. The steak nelly? Yeah. How would you like that cooked? mid -rare. Okay. Please, thank you very much. You're very welcome. I want to see where that 9 out of 10's hitting. Don't leave that there. Yeah, I'm moving it. Mike, I have Chef Ramsay's order. Here we go. Chef Ramsay will like the food here. Anything that I make him, he's going to like. Guaranteed. Look at this place. Disaster. Louis. Chef? What happened to that lamp shade over there on the wall? I don't know. Fix it, it's bugging me. How are you? Nice to see you. It's driving me crazy, I'm sorry. Oh, oh it comes on when it goes up anyway. <laughs> sorry, just watch your head there. That's for the chef, make it nice. I made it so, but it's right on the money. Okay, chef. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. Greeny with shrimp sauce. Greeny with shrimp sauce. Oh dear. Wow, that's gross. Yeah, it's bland. It's just the I mean, sauce is bland. Yeah, everything's watery and shrimp so like rubber. It's horrible. Nowhere near a nine. All right. Would you like me to remove that from your Yes, table? please, darling. The sad part is this isn't even the worst of it. This is bland, watery. The shrimp tastes like rubber. I don't know what he's talking about. I am a perfectionist. I will never put out food unless it's right. Is this the Murphy? Yeah. Oh, I hope he likes that. Oh. Chicken Murphy. Chicken Murphy. Wow. I was afraid to serve him the chicken Murphy. It doesn't look very nice, does it? Um, it's embarrassing. It looks like a stew gone bad. That looks horrible. Okay. Where's the manager? Lewis. Is that the normal style of presentation of Chicken Murphy? Sam, Lexi, girls, um, visually impact. Does that look appetizing to you? Could definitely use an appearance update. A little mush. Mush. A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. After Nelly died, the food's been kind of going downhill. It's kind of at the point where it's necessary for someone to say something. That's gross. It's 
overcooked, just wet, soggy, and just tasteless. I call it a hot mess. I call it a hot joke. Okay. I'm done, thanks, darling. Yes, you're very welcome. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. I can't afford to be up all night with the shits. Oh, excuse me. Thank God you didn't have the chicken Murphy. Bloody hell. Oof. Mike, it's just a hot mess, so. Hey, tough son of a bitch. Chef Ramsay is a ball buster, but if you have an impossible math problem, if Einstein was still alive, you'd talk to him. So we have a restaurant problem. We talk to the master. How you doing? Thing. It's, it's for the better. You can tell that Chef Ramsay being so critical of the food, it kind of hurt my dad a little bit, but my dad needs help, and if this is what it takes, then this is what it takes. What's next? For the finale, it's going to be the steak Nelly. Right. Best of luck. I don't need to give him any more things to hate. I grew up cooking steaks, and I'm a master of the grill. I'm telling you, I'm good at this, man. I'm very good at this. Wow. This is the steak Nelly? Steak Nelly. Is that a steak or charcoal? No, chef, that's a piece of the steak. Wow. Talk to you guys. Oh, God. Wow, that just tastes of burnt charcoal. I feel like I've got a barbecue in my mouth. I've got to taste that. How does that taste for you? Would you give that a nine? No. No. Like you said, it is charcoal. Char That's charcoal. Mike, what do you say? This tastes like it's charcoal. You didn't like that? No. I tried it. It's nothing wrong with it? Well, like you said, there's a little bit of uh, charcoal. There ain't no way in hell I overcooked that steak. That's something that I make that everybody loves, and I never have a complaint. Aren't you going to go out there? What? I don't know. Shouldn't you go out there? You are the owner, so you're supposed to check on things. I hope my dad will be willing to listen to Chef Ramsay and take the criticism and acknowledge that everything isn't perfect. Sit down. Instead of just being mad. Uh, Mike, I'm, uh, you know, I'm embarrassed. We've got some fucking big issues here. I thought the food was dated. I don't know how you control the menu that size. And then some of the things were inedible. The food that was watery, bland, soggy. I know how to cook. Come on, the whole thing just looked an absolute fucking mess. I mean, that last steak? Right. I mean, how do you put a dish like that together? Well, the steak itself is a prime steak, so I mean, uh, my... I was overcooked, so I had no prime. You rated the food nine out of 10, I wouldn't pass it above two. That's not good enough to come back for. Nowhere near it. I mean, I'm just gonna tell you, man to man, it's not true. Either you're in denial, or you don't care. Chef Ramsey said my food was outdated, and you know, I respect him, but I believe he's wrong in this situation. I know what my customers like, and I know what I like. That's the way I like it. Fuck that. Nah, I don't want to give a shit. I'm gonna have a good look at the menu. The menu's huge, right? The menu is huge. The last I counted, there was 126 things on there. <sighs> okay, great. Right, let's start off with, oh, fried ravioli. Love them. Okay. Do you know what? What about the linguine escatori? Okay. What is the catch of the day? That's uh, mahi mahi. Let's do that. Absolutely. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm. Decor's hideous. It's stuck in a time warp. Takes me back to 1981. Okay, I have a fried ravioli for Chef Ramsay. Fried ravioli for the chef. My food is the best food that's possibly made. But the problem with the restaurant is that we're fighting so much. Fried ravioli. Okay. Fried ravioli. What's inside the ravioli, please? Uh, it's a five cheese stuffed ravioli. And the five cheeses are? Uh, I'm not sure. Well, wow. It's a pre-made ravioli. So they're not homemade? They're, those are not homemade. If we don't even make them here, it'd be nice to know what's inside them. I'll find out right now for you. Thank you. How's it going? I need to find out what cheeses are in the ravioli. What cheeses are in the ravioli? Yeah. yeah. What kind of cheese is in the bread and ravioli? Read the box. It's a ricotta cheese, Joe. Okay. It's a ricotta cheese. Oh, my God. Ah, horrible. That's something deep, fried, frozen. It doesn't even taste like cheese. Jesus, no. You got a whole uh, whey, and you got American grana. And uh, a skim cheese. Yeah. OK, perfect. You got it? Thank you, yes. Yeah, not good. 
Ramsey. I checked on the cheeses for you. Uh, mascarpone. Mascarpone. Ricotta. Ricotta. Uh, also, uh, American Garana. Something called a uh, cheese way and culture blend. Where the fuck is that from in Italy? I don't. I have no idea where that's from. Ooh. And a uh, skimmed cheese. Skimmed cheese in a fried ravioli. What does that mean? It's fat-free cheese dipped in fat. Dipped in fat, yeah. OK, thank you. OK. Skimmed cheese in a fried ravioli. Oh, got some pans. Yeah, it looks good. Hey, uh, Joe. Mate, mate. Here, I'll yeah. bring it out, tell him. Oh, damn. Oh, chef, this is the fish special. It's the mahi mahi. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Oh, it's mush. Yeah. Bland, greasy, no seasoning. Fish is dreadful. Um, this is a special fish. Yes, that is a special fish. Mm -hmm. It'll taste funny. It tastes like mush. Almost like it's sort of old. The food just isn't the way it used to be. With all the fighting going on, the standards and the quality, everything, it tanked. And that's special. Holy crap. OK. Uh, he said that this one right here, where the fish was just dreadful. It's all right. I'm still hungry anyway. I can eat that. I absolutely think he's wrong about the mahi mahi. And I thought it was perfectly fine. It was just the way it's supposed to be. That's from the mouth of my chef that knows know, taste probably know. more, OK? That guy's up here, and I'm down here. What do I know if he cooks it good or not? I don't know. It's his opinion. I don't want you to feel bad, because you... I don't feel bad. Right. I know. I'm right, waiting fine. for his opinion. What the hell? Chef Ramsey is here to help us. And my brother takes this attitude that it's all bullshit complaints. It's not. You got to listen to those complaints and keep your mouth shut. So everything is atrocious, Chef. Are you tasting the food? Yeah. I you are, yeah? The fish was cooked properly. It was fresh. Yeah, so it's mush. It tastes excellent to me. OK, let me finish this. Thank you. Thank you. I don't need a guy to tell me that my food sucks. If you don't like the food, then get the fuck out of here. The linguine pescatore. Yeah, what the hell is that? What have done to the calamari? What have done to these bits? There are more tentacles here than there are in SeaWorld. That tastes as bad as it looks. The muscles of the clams were grainy, and calamari had a weird texture to it. Chef, how are you doing with the pescatori? I'm struggling. Struggling? I'm struggling, yeah. I mean, I certainly don't get that taste of Italy, let me tell you that. And the sauce no. is so weak, and it tastes disgusting. Um, are we done? Yes. You can't make everyone happy in life. That's why we need a help. Do this shit. I don't kiss anybody's ass. Take me into the kitchen. I haven't had anyone come into my restaurant and say, Luigi, you don't know what the hell you're doing. Not even Chef Ramsay gets to do that. I'm frustrated. I wish I could say that was an enjoyable lunch. The deep fried ravioli with skinny cheese. Why'd you put that shit on the menu? To give it to the Americans. Come on. Come oh, on, I'm not laughing now. The fish special, that was overcooked and it was bland. That was a, that was a perfect day. You're not telling me that. Come on. It was like cat food. Linguini, pescatore. That one there is the best dish on the menu. It was my signature dish when I opened the restaurant. I'll stick by my food. I've been sticking for 30 years. I have no problem. Yeah, that's the problem there. You've been doing the exact same food for 30 years. I haven't had a challenge in 30 years. No one's ever challenged me. You're the first one. Listen, you've lost your sparkle. I don't believe this is the same man that was the young maestro that was written about 30 years ago. Come on. There's something missing. I don't know what it is on the back of the fragmented relationship you've got with your brother, but the heart's gone. There's got to be some magic somewhere inside that was once there, but I need it back. He can't tell me that I don't know what the hell I'm doing in my kitchen. I've been doing it for 30 years. Ash, I'll take one of everything. One of everything? Yeah. One of everything. Why not? Great way of really getting to see each and every dish, understanding mm -hmm. the flavors, and getting a touch of that authentic Italian cuisine. One of everything on the menu. Yes, please. OK. Thank you. You're welcome. The 
Vincenzo menu is ginormous. You must be insane, because we're going to be here all day. He wants one of everything. What happened? He said he wants one of everything. Just say to him, let me understand. You want one thing on the okay, whole so Cece wants to clarify that you right. do want one of everything. Because right. I hope he hasn't eaten in a week. Oh. This is going to be harder than I thought. Cece says you hope you haven't eaten in a week. It's Wait. a big menu. Have you seen it? I haven't seen the menu. Have a quick look? Yes. Oh, what did I get myself into? It's quite large. Yeah, like that's One, just. Two, three. Oh my god. It's that big. How many dishes are on there? A lot. <laughs> then you have the. Look at it. Mm hmm. Aye, aye. That was a joke, by the way. I hadn't even looked at the menu. I figured that. There must be hundreds of dishes on there. Now, if you haven't eaten for a while, I'll well, be more than happy to prepare Let that. me have a look at the menu and I'll order, yes? I was like, oh, thank God. Okay, so uh, I'm ready to order, thank you. All right. So I'd like to start off with salmon uh, de vino, thank you. And then throw in the uh, snapper anna. Snapper anna? Yeah, the favorito del nonna. Yeah? Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. Okay, here we go. You got salmon de vino ready? Here's your thank salmon you. de vino salad. Well, this looks like a fucked up version of a science lab. Thank you. You're welcome. Wow. Salmon is dry. And overcooked. Fuck to get in that thing. Huh? What is that? <laughs> Do they paste that together in the morning and stick it together? Slice it just now. And is the salmon fresh or is that frozen? Um, I couldn't tell you, to be honest. Would you ask her? Because it yeah. tastes frozen. OK, let me go ask. Thank you. He wants to know if your salmon's fresh or frozen. Tell him it's fresh, but it is frozen. She said the salmon comes in fresh, and then they freeze it. It's like eating a piece of cardboard there. See, that has to be Florida's worst dish ever. He said the salmon divino. He said what? Tastes like cardboard. He's supposed to be here to help me. He's not supposed to be telling me that nothing's good. Give me the snapper, Anna. If he complains about this, I'm really going to fucking kick his ass. Oh, my God. And there's the snapper, Anna, for you. The snapper, Anna? Mm-hmm. I'm just out of interest. Where is the snapper? We're under all that. Under all that. This one looks like a, uh, a dog's dinner. I don't know how well this is going to work. Oh, my God. That just tastes of mush. Is Michael nearby? I'll get them for you. Um, just taste that for me, would you? Please. That's the snapper Anna. It's soggy. Should be baked a little longer. Ah, it's fucking disgusting. Yes, sir. Thank you. Um, would you do me a favor? We make sure that CC tastes that, yeah? I think it's really important. All right. Thank you. What he said? For you to taste. Taste what? He says it's soggy. I'm not, he, he touched that. I'm not going to put my mouth on that. The snapper was soft. Well, what the hell do you want it to be? A hard like a rock? I mean, I don't even get that. Tell me, you know what? She doesn't even want to cook you the rest. Now I'm really getting pissed off. I'm not kidding. She's going mad. Does she all shout That's at her? You know what? As a huh? chef, tell him that I said there's starving people in the world, and if I have to keep making food to go in the garbage, I don't want to make any more. Right now or when I bring in the next No, day? right now. Why should I make him anything else? I don't waste enough. Fuck him. CC said that there's starving people in the yeah, world. Yeah, well, let me just stop you there two okay. seconds. Yeah. She got something to tell me. She should come and tell me herself. Okay. I don't think it's fair that you have to do her okay, dirty good. work for her. <laughs> so tell CC when she's finished cooking, she can tell me everything she wants. Until then, I'm here to eat and to taste the food. I'll tell her. I'd appreciate that. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I didn't want to tell CC the truth at all about anything he said. She's going to probably kill me. She's going to kill the messenger before she even kills Gordon Ramsay. What's that? He said this later, you can tell him yourself. But right now, he wants to try and eat everything. So he is a bigger asshole than I thought. Yeah, fuck him. What? Fuck him. Fuck him? Chef Ramsay. I'm surprised that nobody break his legs here. Here's your pizza. Thank you, honey. And which one is the, uh, oh. That's the favorite of Don Nona. Piece of Nona. Lovely. I don't care how many fucking stars he has. He can kiss my stars. Jesus Christ. I'm so pissed off right now. That's just not nice. Soggy in the middle and crispy on the outside. It's dreadful. It was shame. It's a bit plain. Boring. Yeah. Bland. Thank you. Can I go over there and scream at him? Yes. 
take your knife uh, with you. I'm not going to even say shit. I'm just going to throw it. I tried to throw it in the garbage before she saw me, because I knew she was going to flip. Oh, fucking, no fucking way. What's wrong with that now? He said it was bland. Oh, my God. He said it needed more flavors to it. I was so mad at him, I wanted to rip his head off. He's British. He doesn't fucking know anything about pizza.